So you open up your device management and then you find where your um, video card is, your display driver. Okay. Um, so you open up your display drivers and you'll see this is my particular driver on this particular little laptop I play on. So you double click on that. You go to the details tab. In the details tab, you scroll down to this right here. Right here. Class G UID. This is the value of your driver. Now, before you panic, this is uh, appears to be similar across the board. So you have to keep note of that. It might be worth writing that down. Okay, so the next thing you have to do is edit your registry. This is going to sound scary. It's not that scary. So first thing you have to do is go to your registry editor, which is just type in that in your bar here and you'll get to it. Open it up. It looks like this. So you have to then navigate yourself to where the actual path of the, the, the registry entries that are, that are um, telling your computer where to find the drivers, I guess is basically the best way to put it. H key local machine, click on that. Then you're going to click on system. Then you're going to click on uh, con current control set. Then you're going to expand the control menu here. Then you're going to go to class, click on that, and then you're going to get this awful selection of folders here. But this is where that number you just took note of comes into play. This is the, the number, the details on the driver for the video card. Double click on the zero, zero, zero. And then you have to scroll down in this mess to the names of the two drivers that are giving us problems, which are specifically OpenGL driver name and OpenGL driver name WOW. So if you scroll down, and it's alphabetized, so that makes it a little easier. But here they are. Now, this is where mine is going to look a little different than what yours does. So I've already edited this. My Steam is working. So my path is going to be what the finished product asks it to be. Your path is going to be something like, like Windows, System32, Driver Store, File Repository, and then the name of the driver. And then for the WoW one, the OpenGL driver name WoW, it's going to be something like this. Okay. So leave the registry open, the registry edit open, and, and we'll come back to that in just a second. Okay, so next you have to start digging into your files a little bit. So here's how you have to do this. You open up your Windows Explorer. It looks something like this. Then you need to navigate down to your Windows Drive into Windows. And this is really weird. You have to pay attention to this part. Your C drive used to be called just C drive years ago with Windows. Now it's called Windows C. That's not the Windows drive though. That's just the C drive. And then under Windows, you have to scroll down. You have to open up Windows and then open up further down here. System 32. Then open up Driver Store. Then open up the IG thing, which is further down here. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff here. In case you were wondering, I missed it. I scroll. I gotta scroll back up. It's IG. There it is. Open that up, and then you have to navigate down to those two files, that IG9ICD64, and let me just do that here, IG9, these are the two things that are causing you trouble right here. So if you hover over it, it'll say OpenGL driver for Intel graphics accelerator. So this is what Steam can't find. So what you need to do is control these guys, 
So you're highlighting them both, copy them, and now you have to paste them in Windows. So you have to go all the way back up in Windows, paste it here. Don't paste it here because that's not where it needs to be. Paste it in Windows and you'll see here they are. That's where you want to leave them. We're almost done. Okay, so last step. Remember how you left your reg edit open? Okay, you got to go back to it now. So you're going to be at this. Hopefully you left it open exactly like it was so you don't have to go through all that nonsense scrolling through it again. Here are your two drivers. You have to tell the registry where to look for those two drivers now. So mine's done, so it looks a little different. Yours is going to look like this. Um, there's going to be a long file name here, a long path. Windows System32 Driver Store File Repository. Remember, you just went through all that. So what you have to do is you have to edit that to basically, so you just double click on it, and you have to edit it so it just says that. And you have to do that for both the, the 32 and the 60, 64. Now, once you've done that, it's going to look something like this. You repeat the process for both the drivers. You close the registry editor, you restart your computer, and it should work. You should now be able to run Steam. If you get an error that says can't load the GL driver, it's probably because you put the drivers in the C drive rather than the Windows folder.